Hello everyone, welcome, my name's Ali A and today we've got a brand new trailer showing off the new content which is a part of the third Black Ops 2 map pack which is called Vengeance. It's coming out next Tuesday, the 2nd of July on Xbox and around a month later on PC and PS3. Within this trailer we get an overview of the new multiplayer maps and specific bits of new information to do with the new Zombies map, Buried. And I want to talk about that a little bit more at the end of the video. So enjoy the trailer, give it a like if you're excited and I'll see you guys at the end of the video. So you know the new Black Ops 2 maps are almost here, right? Yeah. So, don't you think it's about time you let me drive again? No. What? <laughs> Come on, okay, I messed up one time. Arnold, you drive yet? Yep. Yeah, Arnold drive the car? Arnold's driving? You don't even have a license! Awesome, so there we go, we've got another look at the new Black Ops 2 map pack. As I said, 2nd of July is when it's coming out and I'm going to have gameplay covering absolutely all of this map pack on my channel as soon as the map pack goes live, so don't worry about that. All the content will be covered here as per usual, but the first thing I want to point out about the trailer is the woman character that we see within the window initially and then attacking us later on in the trailer. When we kill her, she spurts out what looks like to be purple blood. What sort of role she plays, whether she can have a positive or a negative effect on the map, we don't know at the moment. We just know she's an enemy, so it's going to be interesting to see what sort of role she plays. Looks like she's some sort of old civilian from the town that we're in. Of course, it's a sort of Wild West town underground, hence the name Buried, so that's going to be interesting. Now, the next part of the trailer is really cool because it links back in with the first one where they show the character that was locked away in a cage. They told us that he could help us if we did something for him or he could go against us. And we now know how to make him become an ally and help us. We need to give him sweets. Now, there was a sweet shop shown within the first trailer. I I'd assume they'd be in the shop or uh, scattered around the town for us to find and once we feed him these sweets we can see on screen here he becomes an ally and he helps us in some way. How he helps us we're going to have to wait until July the 2nd to find out. Now two things that aren't new but are worth noting within the trailer is one of the locations for the mystery box and also the location for the Juggernog perk. The thing to note about the Juggernog perk is that it seems to be down a very tight corridor, you see the four characters backing into it and if you're trying to go and get it and you're being surrounded by zombies Zombies, it looks like you're going to get trapped so it's going to be a tough place to get the perk. Now the final part of a trailer which was interesting was this huge green zombie which falls from the sky and lands on the floor of a huge crash right at the end of the trailer. I'd assume for him to be some sort of large boss zombie he's definitely differentiated from the other zombies we've seen within the trailer. He looks big, he looks massive, I assume he's going to be some big part of the map which makes it tough to proceed up the round but this is our first look at this zombie. So there we go guys, I hope you've enjoyed another look at the third Black Ops 2 map pack, Vengeance. It's awesome to see more of the zombies action, it looks like a really in-depth, detailed map with lots of things happening at once. We're going to find out what these zombies are all about next Tuesday on July the 2nd and of course I'll be covering everything here on my channel. But thank you very much for watching guys, make sure you check out any of my recent videos if you happen to have missed them and I'll see you guys on my next video.